What are these millions of sparkling lights that visit the sky at night? Every one of those tiny little dots we see is actually a giant ball of fire, just like our sun. There are so many stars in the sky that there are more than all the grains of sand on all the beaches in the world. It's as if an artist has carefully decorated the ceiling of the sky with the most beautiful paintings, isn't it? This beautiful lamp in our room was placed there by a master craftsman with careful planning and intention, wasn't it? So, who decorated the ceiling of our world, which is many times larger than our room with these star lamps? Can this lamp decide on its own? I will stand here and give light. How can millions of stars, which have no mind, say in unison, come on, let's all shine together? Could the paints have come together on their own to create this wonderful painting? Of course not. If the sky is like the most beautiful painting, then an artist must have made it. The stars are not alone. The moon and the planets join them, and none of them ever loses its way. This perfect order that never fails shows us that there is one creator who knows everything with his endless knowledge. Allah, who illuminates the dark night with these lights, is An-Nur. And the one who designs and decorates the sky with the most beautiful shapes is El Musavir, the designer. The one who holds these giant fiery stars in their place is El Kavi, the all-powerful. Let's just think, what if there were no stars? Let's thank Allah for this beautiful gift. Alhamdulillah. Just like the stars, we can be a light to those around us with our kindness and smiles. By turning off unnecessary lights, we can help everyone see this beautiful work of art even better. Remember, everything in the universe is like a letter telling us about its creator.